Rob, what is our third main topic today? Ooh, this one excites me, John. David Ullman says, it looks like Denai Guerrero, who plays Okoye, leader of the Dora Milaje, will not only be appearing in Black Panther Wakanda Forever, but will also be getting her own origin story in the form of a spinoff show. Personally, I think it is a great idea and might show how the Dora Milaje came to be. What are your thoughts? Well, John, Deadline, and we know everything on Deadline's true, which is true, so just believe it. We hear from sources that Denai Guerrero will be returning as a Koye general of the Dora Milaje in Ryan Coogler's upcoming Black Panther Wakanda Forever, as well as reprising her character in an origin spinoff series for Disney+. Plus. Disney didn't have any comment about today's report. It would not come as a shock if Guerrero also stars in the Wakanda series, which Coogler is developing for Disney+. Plus. Look, my love for this character of Okoye uh, is, is immense. I love <laughs> the Dora Milaje. I love Denai Guerrero. I love Okoye. And, you know, the first thought I had is finally Hot Toys will make us a Hot Toys figure of her and perhaps at least maybe a three-pack so I can get three of the Dora Milaje to guard my my uh, uh, Wakandan uh, entourage of figures. And I just, I want to see this so bad. I loved the way they were portrayed in in Black Panther. And I think that the, the whole idea of like this secret agent police force slash army slash awesomeness, uh, I, I can't wait to see this. And I loved her character. I was a little, little disappointed she didn't show up in Falcon and the Winter Soldier, but that's okay because the way the Dor Dora Milaje was represented in that series rules. I just want to see more of that. And um, why not? Why didn't they announce this first? They should have I've been waiting for this, John. Waiting, waiting, and now I'm getting it. Uh, the, first of all, obviously, uh, she's coming back. Yeah. Obviously, you have to have Okoye in Wakanda Forever. And if you're yeah. going to do a series a Disney Plus limited series, whether it's limited or whether it's ongoing, whatever, on Disney Plus about Wakanda, you got to have her in there. Now, the one thing that I did notice, though, Rob, is that there are people misquoting what was actually in that deadline report because, as was written in the email, people, there are some people running around saying that the Disney Plus series is going to be an Okoye origin story. Right. It's important to go back and note that that's not what the article said. Like, let's look at this again. The article says uh, she's going to be in Ryan Coogler's upcoming Black Panther Wakanda Forever, as well as reprising the character in an origin spinoff series for Disney+. Plus. And then they go on to say they're not even sure she's the star of it. They just wrote, it would not come as a surprise or shock if Guerrero is also the star of that series. Like, so right now, Deadline isn't even certain she's like a lead in this series. They're not even sure she's a lead in the series. So they are definitely not saying, the article is not saying that this Disney Plus series is an Okoye origin story. That's not what it said. Some people are running with headlines like that. Rob, that's not to say it can't possibly be that. It's just important to note right now that that's not what the story itself says. This just story says it is an origin story. They won't be surprised if, you know, Koye is a lead, but they're not saying she is. They're not saying it's an Okoye origin. That's important to note. Other than that, sign me up. I mean, I mean, sign sign me up. Listen, I, I love this cast. I think her as a Koye has always killed it. First, first of all, all of them have been awesome. Like watching them also in uh, watching the Dora Milaje and Falcon the Winter Soldier without uh, Okoye was fantastic as well. Fantastic. Um, yeah. You put Naki in there with the future ex Mrs. Campia, Lupita Nuango. Yeah, you put her in there too. Now, they haven't said that she'll be in the series, but I, I definitely hope she is. Um, there's nothing but, as you would say, Rob, ooey gooey goodness in all this story. So, yeah, on the one hand, it's a no brainer. Yeah, of course she's back. Uh, you, you're not going to do a Wakandan thing without a Koye. She's just far too valuable to this thing. But at the same time, it is welcome news, even if it was expected. Question is for you guys What do you think 
about this news about having Danai Danai being a, back in both the movie and in the television series, even if we're not quite sure what the television series is right now. And by the way, Iconic Reaction sends in a super chat badge in the live chat. Thank you, Iconic. Um, what do you guys think about that? Jump on down into the comment section below and let us know your thoughts. Okay, guys. <sighs> 